Yeah, guys, I finished reading chapter 12 last night. I'm sorry, it's just... Yeah, I'm telling myself my first priority, top first priority, is to, is to finish up the semester. Okay. <coughs> my second top priority... Um, I might have to... If... If uh, Liz doesn't have any ideas about this, then I would have to go downtown to that Micklet place, tell them about my issues, about my back and my money issues, and say this is what has to be done. I need a back injection, and I'm getting a run around here, saying go for walks. Nothing else can be done, and. My emotional state and mental state is draining because I'm in a lot of pain when I walk. Something has to be done. Like a back injection. And the doctors are not helping me with this. They're not helping. Nothing else works. Nothing. And I can't go to physical therapy because, you know, I get in pain on the bike. I try really hard. To fight my pain, I try, and I just can't do it anymore. Something has to be done, and I'm thinking about getting a lawyer. In case I get a run around, a run around, a run around. So that way, if I do become cripple, which I fear, I could sue for malpractice and get their license provoked out, out of the window. Because they don't deserve to be doctors and nurses. Whoever get me in the run around will be out of jobs it's not gonna be my fault but their fault I'm autistic just like I said you can't wash off the arthritis off your bones it's not like sweat okay now um, I was like telling myself oh I got to make a, a eye appointment I know that it's been a while since I had an eye appointment done probably a year and a half ago and so Okay, if I get out and I get off by the YMCA and it's like downtown a couple of blocks. Yeah, a couple of blocks. A couple of blocks. That's a problem. And, and with this windy weather coming soon, with the snow blowing and all that shit, I will not tolerate it. I can't handle that. I tried in the past. I tried to handle that. I fucking tried so hard to handle that. You know, and I just, I just can't, I just can't, um, I, I just, I just can't, you know, it's like a trigger, it's like, you know, a sensory trigger, I just can't stand wind thing, windy things, I can't stand hot climates, I can't stand pain. I can't stand my pain tolerance, and that's what they don't understand. You either help me sign a referral, or I will sue your ass for malpractice if something really does bad happen. It's not a threat, it's a promise, and I'm not drug-seeking either. Not a drug-seeker, I don't do drugs. I don't do illegal drugs. And they need to understand that. Losing weight is not helping, either. I lost 9 pounds, and then I gained 12 pounds back, and then I lost 3 pounds yesterday. So, I don't know what else that can be done. I'm just fed up. You know, it's like, I gotta get this done for my physical health and my emotional health, because it's just too much. It's just too much. Something has to be done, and it has to be taken care of ASAP, or I will sue their ass off if something really, really fucking bad happens to me. I will do what I, whatever I have to do. Whatever I have to do, I will do, and that's final. I'm not going to give up without a fight. I don't care if I'll be on the news like 2020 saying, oh, medical neglect. I got paralyzed because of medical neglect. Not funny anymore. 
Oh, it's not your fault. It's not our fault that you got paralyzed. It's your fault. We told you to go out walking more. Well, I told you I can't walk that far. Do I have to have a slam a hammer on your fucking head? How stupid can you be? I tell you, people, people, people. Some people cannot be doctors or nurses sometimes. Jesus Christ. I'm just. But yeah. I found my turkey breast on Swiss cheese and cranberry wild rice bread. I'm gonna eat this now. This is gonna be my um, breakfast. So. I'm just fed up, guys. I'm just. I'm to the point of being fed up, you know? Something has to be done, and I mean it. Something has to be done. So that's going to be my future. I'll be on the news channels if I have to in order to get this done. I will do whatever it takes in order to be heard. You know? God, Lord. Where's that TV show I want to watch? Yeah, can't find it in my thing. Oh, here it is. I like to watch sliders. I, I watch sliders, like, all the way through, like, past even season five. And I'm re-watching them again. I like this show. And again, it's on Peacock. And, yeah, I read somewhere that they're going to have a new season, season six, with an all-new cast and stuff like that, because they got stuck in this um, parallel universe, something happened. I, it's just, to watch season five, oh, all the seasons through, and I, I can't remember what happened, <laughs> but something happened. They, it's like, oh, I don't know if who will survive the jump, and so someone, I can't remember who, went through first, and then the a wormhole closed, leaving them behind, and they have to stay like 29 years in that place where they are. So, so I'm not gonna think about this fucking back shit. I'm just that's my two cents, okay? When people have, when people have, um, like. Like a disability, like autism, and they have um, sensory disorders, like pain. They can't tolerate pain. You have to fucking listen. Like seriously, oh, this came apart. <laughs> what the heck? See, this whole bread thing came apart here. But yeah, you know. It's good. So. So that's the plan. So. I'm going to shut up. Watch my sliders. And probably watch more of Resident Alien. And so, okay. If you think you might be pregnant, you want to know. ASAP. Hey, I'm free, right away. Yeah, you know, I like the taste of the market one better than the quick trip. The market one. For whatever result you're looking for. Why they don't have any more of those sandwiches out that I like, though. I don't understand that. Early digital pregnancy test from Clear Blue, America's most trusted brand.
You promise. I have this teacher. She's great. She's like my mom. She told me. Who is she? Another witch, like a high priestess or something. She said you were the coolest and I would like you the best. <laughs> she was right. <laughs> well, I'd like to meet her sometime. Yeah? Is your room up there? Mm-hmm. Come on. I want to share something with you. <laughs> You're going to love it. I promise.
I remember they actually have some photos of all of us when we were little kids in the garden. I could find them and show them to you. Totally fucking do it. Get to know you better. Unless there's somewhere you need to be. Oh, no, um, that sounds great. Okay, I'll be right back. Sounds like we have a plan, then. Okay. Hey, Andy, can you give Lorna a ride? It's, it's getting really dark out there. No, it, it's okay. I can walk. Hi guys, I'm watching the black phone. I've watched it before, so um, yeah, I'm not gonna miss anything if I uh, share something right now. Yes, as I stated, I finished chapter twelve, but however, when I was like reading it, I was like kind of skimming through everything, trying to get everything remembered in my head. But right now, I am looking through important things to write down, write down by hand so that um i can get stuff right like i understand quotations but they have it differently like i don't know i just don't want to get it complicated or something so maybe if i show it to you i don't know what i how else i can say it but yeah i'm doing something like that and damn it it's been a rough day today i'm trying not to fucking obsess about this backing injection shit and I know it's like two weeks away but fucking god it's just I'm just fear that 
Baker's nurse practitioner will say, Oh, you have to walk, honey. You have to walk every day. Well, I can't walk every day unless I have a fucking back injection, period. Just like I'll say no about physical therapy unless I have a back injection, then fine, I will do physical therapy. I mean, how much does it have to take? Seriously. For them to understand that, you know? Good lord, guys. This is... I'm so pissed off, too. About another thing. Why... Why is... Okay, should I show you the quotations first or after? Uh, I don't know. I'll show you this doctor thing. thing. Give me a sec. Here's my frustration right here. I don't fucking understand this. Person A, these are scenarios. Person A has symptoms of an illness. They see a doctor, tell the doctor their symptoms, then the doctor finds out what's wrong and gives them the antibiotics. There, that's simple. You're healed, you're done. Person B has a toothache. They go to their dentist. Their dentist either gives them a root canal or a cavity filling. No more toothache. There. Problem solved. Person C has period issues. They see their gynecologist. Their gynecologist... Uh, I can't talk. The, the gynecologist either says, after an examination, you need surgery or you need a... You need birth control. Person C either gets surgery or birth control and no more period issues. There. Problem solved. Done. Person D has back issues with their back. They can't walk long distances. They tell their doctor this again and again. They get ignored. What the fuck is wrong with this society? Seriously. Why... Why is everything else so fucking simple and getting treatment for back pain is the hardest thing is like pulling teeth for somebody when they're not sedated or don't have numbing on their mouth. What the fuck, you guys? Serious to God. I'm sick and tired of getting this run around. It has to stop. See, this is a little tricky right here. These are the kind of things. See what I mean? Figure 17, comma, page 9, normal punctuation, emphasis, the enclosed material. See, figure 17, dash. Okay. And the enclosed material. That's what I could get confused about. Um... Okay, and a comma after this. Okay. You know what I mean? Okay. Apartment is in Okay. Okay. Comma. With small as. Okay. I, I just need to relook this over and take notes like this, you know? Okay, let me see. To show numeral and enclosed numeration items. Okay, stuff like that. (laughs) 
Okay, Google's happy we tried it. You know, just in case, because some of the quizzes have asked if what is the correct way of saying this sentence, and it shows different, um, options, okay? I wonder if I can show you an example of what I'm saying here. Sorry if this is long here. I'm just going to show you an example of a quiz. Quiz 11. Chapter 10 quiz. Where's chapter 10? 11 quiz. Okay. Okay, you see what I mean? And I got that correctly. And it shows, um, see what I mean? Beth, whoever. Okay, this was the correct answer, and this was the one I. So I gotta not be, um, I need to, uh, be aware on how to say things. Okay. This is the correct answer. Learning of classic. Okay. Okay, because of the word therefore is used. Therefore, comma. But there was a comma right there, and that's why I'm confused. See that? Learning, learning, effective, effective, communi communication skills. And then there's a semicolon right here. Maybe that's what. Therefore. I got confused, but again, I was feeling tired as fuck yesterday, so that's why I got a lot wrong. And some of the quizzes look like this. And I bet, <clears throat> I bet the next quiz looks something similar like this, so I need to take my notes and, yeah, so, mm-hmm, 17 out of 30, so, and yeah, um, one more attempt available, and usually, like I said, I'm more of a one-timer person. I'm like, whatever, if I get a lot wrong or some wrong, whatever, because he's a real-world editing thing, um, email thing, is I get 100% on him anyway. So, I'm not going to hit take quiz again and redo it because I, it's just less, more stressful that way, you know, and I don't want to be stressed out so we, this is just a thought so this is why I'm taking notes and looking at the notes on my on, on my um notepad so and so let me see I read chapter 12 I can do World editing, that'd be 30 points, so that'd be 100%. Um, now the quiz. I bet the quiz now, that'd be 30 points, and the quiz will look like the other one. And then, this looks as simple as fuck. I mean, that looks simple. That's it's like 63 points, guys. 63 points. I could probably have this done in seconds. So, 
I'm going to be busy with all this and not obsess, not worry about the November 17th date. Just say you got to help me or I will contact a lawyer, which, I'll, which I promised myself I would do. And maybe my therapist, Liz, let me go back on I was thinking video. too, maybe my therapist, Liz, will um, have to hand over the session notes about this. I am going to get very demanding as fuck, you guys. Very demanding as fuck. I mean, I don't want to be a cripple. I don't want to be the person who would have to be crawling on the ground and floors to get to a destination that they need to go. I would have to buy knee pads, um, elbow pads, and a good pair of gloves and a good backpack to carry all my shit in. Because I'll be crawling to places if I really, really fucking can't walk anymore. How do you feel about that? Do you want me to be in that much pain to where I have to, to where I have to do that? Are you fucking kidding me? Do I need to do all that shit? I'll do whatever it's fucking have to take, motherfucker. It's either that or go on a hunger strike and say, hey. I'm yeah. not eating a damn worse full of food unless yeah. you do the back injection. That's final. And if I die, then I die trying. Fucking sick of this bullshit. It shouldn't be that fucking hard. To request a back injection. Okay, sure. I understand where you're in so much pain. Boop. Referral for pain management. Ding, 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 ding. Pain management. They look you over. They do x-rays or whatever else how they do, whatever they do for a job. Oh, you deserve to have a back injection. Ding, 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 ding. That easy. Why isn't that that hard to do? My fucking God. Jesus fucking Christ. No one should fucking go on a hunger strike or seek a fucking goddamn lawyer. If something that simple has to be done. My God in heaven. Jesus Christ, it shouldn't be that hard. I'm praying, I'm praying hard that it will soon have to be that simple. Well, I will have to take drastic measures to either seek a lawyer, and if that doesn't help, hunger strike. So, I gotta do what I have to do. I'm fucking sorry as fuck, but I have to do what I have to do. I don't want to be crippled, and I don't want to be crawling on the floor or outside on my hands and knees with knee pads and elbow pads and a backpack on my back to carry my stuff in. I am not going to have that happen. They either have to help me out, I see a lawyer, and if that doesn't work, hunger strike, and that is final. Those are my only options.
This is being independent together. Walgreens. Frightening free radicals are everywhere. Luckily, Palm Wonderful's antioxidants help defend against them. Real life is scary. Protect yourself from free radicals with Palm. He just fell from the ceiling. We're not going to address that? Let the big man roll! Look at this, you guys. Look, 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 look. I just wanted to show this to you real fucking quick. Just look at this. Like, isn't that pretty or fucking what? Holy crap. So gorgeous. Holy crap. Wow. It's amazing. Yeah, I walked my way to the bathroom and then I looked out my window and I'm like, oh, wow. I had to show this to you. But yeah, I'm going to go to the bathroom and I'm taking notes about something else. I found my example what I was looking for. Okay. I, sh I found out what might confuse me. So I'll show it to you real quick before bathroom and then I'll go to the bathroom and then I'll do the quiz. Okay, alrighty. This is what I'm talking about. This is what could confuse me. Single quotation marks are not on most keyboards. Okay, Dolores remarked comma. And it says up here, capitalize the first word in the direct quotation. Okay. And do not capitalize not. See that? Okay, writing an act of faith, comma, said this, E.B. White, comma, quotation mark, quotation mark. Okay, quotation mark, after faith, and, um, comma, after white, 
not a trick of grammar. Okay, that could be confusing for me too, and I'll do that with that. Um, so anyway, I totally agree with our slut, whatever that name is, comma, who said, comma. So I gotta remember who, our slut, comma, who said, comma, and then they did like a one quotation C and A, comma, see that? And then, okay, and the quotation, double quotation, okay? Single quotation marks within double quotation marks. So, I gotta remember, I totally agree with so-and-so, comma, who said, comma. I gotta remember that. That could be confusing for me for the quiz. Writing an act of faith, faith, comma, E.B. White, comma, not a trick of grammar, period. Okay, double quotation, okay? So, I gotta remember those. I have to remember that. So, in close direct quotation marks, 12-7a. All right, I'm gonna go to the bathroom now and I'm gonna finish writing this note down. Okay. All right. Okay. The blood relative of a narcissist sociopath. And I did the uh, page number in the textbook. If I need to look at more, I can keep it open on there. Say. No. I can see you. All for right. What you really are. All righty. You're just the. I am gonna. Jellyfish. Of Get this set here. And try to twist Everything this to over here so I can. Fine. Okay. You can try to litigate it, but that's going to be an expensive option. I can't see. Whatever it takes, dear. I'm going to do whatever it takes. I'll do what I got to do. And that'd be good. If you sign this document, forfeit your share of the trust. Oh, yep. 15 out of 30. That's uh, 15 wrong. Uh, of 30. Exactly. Yeah. 30 take away 15, that's 15. <laughs> but like I said, um... I'm a one-timer kind of person with quizzes. It's just, I don't want to go through all that anxiety doing quizzes. It's just one time, boop, one time attempt at it, and that's it. And I have the real world, real world editing thing to do, and that would give me 100% because I have that trick. So. I know I didn't treat you the way you should have been treated. more hot human. It's a lot like it killed himself.
right, you guys. I was checking my mail. I got some mail. You know, mostly newspapers and all that. But yeah. And when I came back upstairs, um, yeah, my neighbor, I told her what I'm frustrated about. Her name is Lori. I told her what I'm frustrated about. And she goes, yeah, I have that issue too with my health. And, and I go, um, well, I did demand and I did say harshly, hey, I'm in pain, I'm in pain. And they always say, go for walks. And I tell them I can't. I tell them that every time. And she goes, tell them you need something stronger, like a strong medication. You know? And I told her I requested a back injection. I don't know how many times. And I and I asked her, is it okay if I can seek legal action if I have to? And she goes, oh yeah, oh yeah, you can. So there you fucking have it. I'm serious, it's a fucking heart attack. It has to be done. So I'm gonna find a free lawyer. I'm going to have Liz help me do that. There's someone out there whatever it takes, my whatever it takes, I'm willing I'm asking to do you that. To look into your heart and to come forward with I don't want to be on a hunger strike. No, no, no. Okay. If you want me to live a long life, you, you better this. not give me that option to be on a hunger strike, man. I, I don't want to do that. Don't give up. And yeah. <laughs> I also have an issue with turning on the, what did I, um, okay. I have an issue with turning on the, uh, okay. This right here is the light switch to this garbage disposal. And it's not turning on. So, I wrote a work order about it. That's why else I was checking my uh mail. So anything All right. So I'm going to say. Appreciate that. And I do want to talk about Linda to Linda about something too when I see her. What happened yesterday on Facebook? Of course. Again, I don't think it's okay to talk to that person. Fuck no. I just mean even though she sounds sane now. Leave me nice comments, way. hey, but I can't trust her in the future. I I don't well, I know I shouldn't worry about the future, but I know her. She was like that in the past. I say, Oh, she's fine. And then I don't want to be subjected to that. That's why I stopped talking to her. That's why I cut ties with that person. My god, jeez. One thing after another. I can't believe she messaged me either, jeez. I don't want to be subjected to that. I cut ties with her like eight years ago for fuck's sake and out of the blue yesterday she commented on my Facebook status. Jeez Louise. I gotta tell Linda about this. I got, because I shared with Linda uh, um, chapter one in my Norna novel. So I want to know what her thoughts and reaction to that is. So yeah, I don't think that's right to be in communication with that lady if she's going to act like that, you know, how she acted in the past. No, I can forgive someone for their actions like that, but no, I don't want to be their friend. I'm sorry, I just, I'm, I can't be subjected to negativity and drama like that. Just like I am with Suzanne, fuck no. This is interesting. Well, it confirms what I felt earlier, Romance. Do you want to learn the British accent? No, you will. Very soon. The British accent, huh? He's not gonna look like that, is he? Ah! <laughs> no, I don't think so. Uh, no, he's gonna be tall. And his name is Derek. Congratulations, I'm sure you'll both be deliriously happy. Miss Flint, uh, about finding you, Mrs. Ashcombe. No, I didn't find anything. Of course. Yeah, of course. Uh, did, did, did you know? Who am I speaking to? Tell me. What is your name? 
that's a woman reported missing in San Antonio. Travel agent, 32 year old Jenny Zipatone. Jenny? Yeah. We contacted Miss Flint after the success she had with your wife. We thought we'd use her again. And, and? She's been on her trail all day. We followed her here. We think she's in your house. You can't be serious. Jenny? Is that you? transfer justice in the court system. Okay. David Goss was returned to New York where he was convicted of rape, sodomy, burglary, and yes. robbery. Goss was sentenced to a prison yes. term of 20 to 40 years and will not be eligible for parole until Doesn't 2017. Don't have one? Doesn't. Coming up, a man okay. has only what? one clue to the identity it? of his no. father. You try and try and try, huh? Wow. Okay. Previously, we brought you Did the tale unable to okay. understand. Why? I don't think we are dealing with it. I don't think that she can deal with this. My youngest son this morning told me when I came here how long are you going to be? You have to be really careful in the car. Something could happen to you. Those are the fears that he has. Because I'm his only parent that, that's left. My two older daughters can't even speak about this. It's unfathomable to, to have to experience this. Next, two families search for their long-lost children. Perhaps your help <laughs> G53 N43 I18 N40 I24 Round over severe facial injuries, a lot of facial trauma, bladder and large blood vessels. These will be sent to the lab and tested for drugs. The results will be critical in determining if Michael committed suicide. We take the blood uh, from his iliac <laughs> veins, as little as we can get from the rest of his Chest cavity. 
Based on forensics and the testimony of his wife, Alyssa, Michael's fentanyl patch is administered around 8 p.m. that same evening, five hours prior to his death. Unfortunately, what happens after he went to bed remains a mystery. You know, the wife really wasn't seeing what was going on. What was he doing there? From the extremely high level of fentanyl in his blood, Dr. G knows that the medication entered his system very quickly, which is not the way a patch is supposed to work. All right. Um, at least I got that quiz done. I tried. <laughs> Whatever. I told you it would be tricky. Some of the sentences look the same. And I kind of tell the difference from some of them. So it was really, really hard to determine which was the correct sentence, you know? So I did try really hard. It's hard as I fucking possibly could. I tried really, really hard, you guys. At least I got 15 wrong out of 30, but oh well. Um, I'm gonna take my shower now. And, um, uh, get going to bed, so, yeah. So, you know, who knows the rules? No banging and, um, like, no making noise and, uh, no touching things. And yes, hug and kiss Patty like there's no fucking tomorrow. <sighs> okay. Fucking love that cat. fucking cold in here. Number one, they invalidate your feelings. It's normal for disagreements to cause emotional distress in all parties involved. However, if you find that someone makes comments such as you're being sensitive or you're so weak, when you express your needs, take it as a possible sign that gaslighting may be involved. 